Hey, what up, gamers, and welcome to Gamers Pack. We have a huge treat for you. I'm with the legendary Patrick Creedon, and we're going to be talking about all work, all play. Edit. You, you know, you have you have a lot of movies, IO, USA, yep. and whatnot. So, guys, stay tuned right now. We're going to be showing you the world of esports through the eyes of Patrick Creedon, of course. So, guys, my name is Jazzy, and welcome to Gamers Pack. Come on. All right, gamers, I'm right here with Patrick. Patrick, thank you for joining us. For, oh, my God. Thanks for coming over, Jazzy. All work, all play. I, Dude, I, guys, gamers, I just watched this, and I'm telling you right now, I have a huge, a brand new, like, love for esports because, like, this movie, this was it. This is one of those few documentaries that really highlighted esports the way I loved it, and mm -hmm. you actually took it to the next level. But, you know, before we get to that portion of that content, Patrick... IO USA, and you're doing all these other documentaries, yeah. and now you're in the esports world. So how did this come up? We we love making documentary mm -hmm. films. We've been doing right. it a long time, and our first movie was a was a movie about a game. It was a movie about the New York Times crossword mm -hmm. puzzle. Right, right, puzzle, right, right. Game, whatever you want to call it. And in that movie, the movie is called Wordplay. And in that movie, we, we hung out with a group of people who really loved this one game. Right. And they were really good at it. They were really competitive. It was a tournament. And uh, it was a great film. This is really a similar story. Mm -hmm. This movie, it's about esports. Right. It's a big universe. There's a, lot of, there's a lot going on within the world of esports. But what we did was we, we focused on one tournament, the right. Intel Extreme Masters. <laughs> Uh, which goes off uh, once a year in March every year. It's in Poland mm -hmm. where the world championship is. We focused on that tournament. We focused on one game, a game called League of Legends, which I'm sure a lot of you play. And we spent a year with the people who organized the tournament and the different teams competing in the right. tournament and took it all the way through to the championship. Mm. And mm -hmm. what's kind of amazing about the movie is we finished shooting it in March and April right. and it's, july <laughs> so how do you make a movie that fast what we did was we were editing really intensely all throughout production jesus and then when the ending happened we sort of crafted the story around the ending and went back and chopped some extra stuff afterwards and here we go we have a movie now that, that we're really excited to share with with people and you know one thing mm -hmm. about the movie that that i'm really proud of it's a movie that gamers really like but it's also a movie that gamers friends and family and siblings also like it's 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 kind of a it's kind of a mainstream movie about esports if you will. right and like the great thing about the movie is that you guys oh my god like when i watched the movie i love the fact that you guys were at the forefront of making history because I, I cannot ruin the movie right now no, if you guys okay. haven't seen no esports spoilers. no spoilers but you guys were there when GE Tigers was there, when stuff happened to TSM, and you're and yeah. you know, you guys were at the forefront of this uh, of literally esports in history, and you guys recorded it and made it epic in the in the documentary, and that was that that to me was amazing. How was the experience of finally experiencing esports for yourself and for your team? It was fantastic. I mean, I think you know, I'm I look back on the early days of things like professional football, professional baseball, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, right, the right. early days of, of professional golf or tennis or you name it. And there are all these sort of these legends that helped create this sport that we all know and love now. And while we were making the movie, while we were making All Work, All Play, it occurred to me, like, I'm hanging around with the founders of esports. Yeah, like, right, right. Like 50 years from now, wherever esports ends up going, People are going to look back at this moment in time, and they're going to say, wow, this movie has TSM in it. This movie has Cloud9. Mm -hmm. This movie has the GE Tigers. It has, it, it's, you spend a lot of time explaining how the game League of Legends works and the different intricacies about the right. game. And I think that that's going to be really valuable, not just now, but years from now. People are going to mm -hmm. look back and be like, wow, look at what was happening kind of at the very beginning of esports. 
honestly, and that's the greatest thing about this movie is the fact that it both caters towards gamers who love esports and it caters for people who don't understand what esports is. And you guys <laughs> explained it really well in this documentary. And that's why I, I highly support this. This is right. an awesome Thank documentary you, to watch and whatnot. Um, I had my team, gamers, I had my team watch and all of us were just like having a lot of fun and whatnot. But I am so excited to finally see this movie and finally... Uh, uh, share this movie with you guys but in any case patrick before i before i go um when and where can i see this movie and how can i get my 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 eyes to watch it or how can i get my hands to see it you know how can i get on this movie i'm not sure how you're gonna get your hands to see it but <laughs> if you want your eyes to see it and your ears to hear it yeah uh you go to the you go to your local movie theater mm -hmm. on tuesday july 21st uh we're going to be playing in North America in about 750 movie theaters. It's a one-night-only special event. You go buy your ticket at your local movie theater. You go down. We do a one-hour live esports extravaganza, which will be simulcast into the theaters. Jesus. And then at the end of that esports extravaganza, we're going to have the movie. And the movie's about 90 minutes long. So it's two and a half hours of really once-in-a-lifetime esports entertainment. Um, and to find where your local theater is, go to esports in cinema, esportsincinema.com. Chances are there's a movie theater really near where you live that'll be showing this movie on Tuesday, July 21st, which is just a few days from now. Uh, we're also going to have a repeat of the whole show a week later. Right. So if you can't make it on the 21st, come back on the 30th. If you happen to be watching overseas, that one night only event is going to be on July 28th. So I know there's millions of fans out there mm -hmm. who love League of Legends, uh, who love esports in general. Um, it's really easy to find out where the movie's going to be playing in the theater near you. One thing I should say about the, the live event, which is kind of right. cool, is for all you StarCraft II fans out there, <laughs> we're going to be doing a live head-to-head -head competition with, with uh, Huck is going to be playing, Huck is going to be playing, um, a couple of other players are going to be showing up that night. And they're going to do an Archon Mode challenge, which is like a 2v2 challenge mm -hmm. for StarCraft, which is really kind of cool. I've, ac I've actually never seen Archon Mode. I think that that's kind of a, a relatively new version of, 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 of playing that game. Mm -hmm. So that'll be there for all the StarCraft 2 fans. And there'll be talk of League of Legends and talk of IEM, and there'll be a lot of esports celebrities there. And then at the end of that live one-hour show that's when the movie will begin right afterwards. So it's it's a it's a great way to go out and hang out with other gamers. <laughs> and the, the whole reason we did this was just because mm -hmm. we know how much gamers enjoy hanging out together. Right, and that's and, true. And there, mm -hmm. I don't think there's enough opportunities for gamers to do that right now. Right. That's why we released the movie in theaters the way we're doing this. Now, months down the road, the movie will be out on iTunes, it'll be mm -hmm, out on, mm -hmm. on Netflix, and there'll be other places to see it. But for this really special event, that's happening next week. Right. And literally, as you said, yeah. all work, all play. All work, all play. All right, guys. Well, there you guys have it. Patrick, it's going to be a wonderful Thanks opening. Over, I Man, yo, really I am excited for this. Guys, remember to check out this movie coming out on July 21st. And, of course, if you guys missed it, July 30th. So, guys, make sure you guys stay tuned. And I'll see you guys soon. Thank you for coming with us here there, and whatnot. Are there gamers out there? Yeah, they're gamers. Yeah, they're right gamers. Now? They're looking at the you. Right? Are they? Yeah. You sexy beasts, you. Look at you. Look at you. <laughs> we'll see you Tuesday night at yep. the movie theaters. Mm -hmm. Yep. And if you want to check out that movie, you guys have to go to this website in the description below, esportsincinema.com. That's where you guys get the tickets and information for which theaters will be playing this. You guys really have to check this out. And of course... Anything and everything in the video game industry, you guys got to stay right here at GamersPack.com. So until next time, gamers, this is Patrick, and I'm Jazzy. Until next time, gamers, keep on gaming. See you at the movies.